What's up, guys? Horror movie ratings by me. This just looks funny. Joe, Nicolas Cage. Pet Cemetery. I haven't seen it. I've seen the first, like, original one and the remake. I liked the remake, but I also did it. But it was, it was trippy. It kind of reminded me of Poltergeist, if that makes sense. But My Bloody Valentine. I actually really liked that movie. And, like, 2009, a lot of good stuff came out. Like, 2009 and before, I feel like, is when the best stuff came out. And, I mean, so it's about a guy who was an old miner, and he would unalive people. They went down there and didn't believe it, blah, blah, blah. There's terrorizing in the town. They go down there, and it's just a bunch of bloody fun. Um, empty Man, I keep seeing that, but I don't know. Darkness Falls. I think this is about the evil tooth fairy, isn't it? Yeah, dude, this is a good-ass movie. I would, I would recommend watching this. Basically, it's like an evil tooth fairy that steals children. Um, highly recommend. Day After Tomorrow. I feel like that's a very nostalgic movie for me, too. It came out when I was 10, so. I watched that a lot. My my, uh, my grandma liked it a lot. I don't know if Jake Gyllenhaal was in it, but it's very possible. I already talked about that. <clears throat> okay, I was gonna make a joke, but it really wasn't funny. The Forgotten was trippy. My grandma really liked that movie. Um, I don't remember. Oh uh, yeah, I think her son actually was like in the bottom of the plane. And she's tripping out because her kid was with her or whatever. I thought it was a daughter. I, dude, I don't know if this is part of the, um, you know, like, what's that, the Mandela effect? But I swear, like, I've seen two different versions of this movie. The Forgotten. Um... I thought her husband and daughter passed, and that's what they tell her, that she's, like, tripping out, um, and she thinks they went on a walk, they, I guess they went on a walk and, like, got hit by a drunk driver or something, but she gets on a plane and there's, like, illicit substances in, uh, in a coffin, because she's actually going with the coffin, I, I don't know, I, I just swear I've seen multiple, multiple, uh, movies of this. I'm trying to understand how this is part of the cast and crew. But, uh... Oh, because you play, you play the, the, the evil tooth fairy. Okay, never mind. Max Payne. I really like this movie. Um, I don't know what to compare it to. But it, it was good. And uh, Manson had a song in it, so that was a plus. Let's go back, guys.